I've worked here as the chief nurse for three years. I've moved my whole family to Norfolk and I'm guessing that you would like to come and work in an organisation that's a tertiary centre, regional leader across many services, that has a vibrant city by the coast and rurally too. Now I could tell you lots of things about this organisation that were all phenomenal, but actually I want you to hear from our clinical leaders, our ward unit and department managers and all of their teams about the 365 reasons why you want to come and work with us. It's a great place. From a nursing point of view, all of our nurses rotate. So the nurses that uh, are on CCU are able to work on Kilverstone and, and vice versa. So we have a a rotation um, for all of the nursing staff so they rotate sort of every three to four months from Kilverstone to CCU and obviously into the cath lab as well because we need those circulating skills of a night and a weekend so from a nursing point of view you've kind of got sort of three jobs in one which is great. Those patients that come in say if you take a heart attack patient that's really sick you know they obviously go through to the cath lab and then on to coronary care and as they gradually get better over to the water the point of discharge. It's exceptionally rewarding actually that you're able to really support those patients and actually you know make them better to be able to go home and actually in terms of kind of supporting the family as well that's a huge aspect of our care. We work really closely with the inpatient area so yes there are patients who will come in as an emergency in the middle of the night sometimes on call and they'll be very very unwell and we'll do our procedure they'll go back to coronary care unit and you will see a couple of days later that they, they go home. Um, so it is really nice to see that sort of patient journey and sometimes they'll come back as an elective patient a few months later down the line for a follow-up procedure. It is nice to see the difference that we've, we've made. The service here has grown massively. We had started with one cath lab when I was here and now we're building number five. No electrophysiology service and now one of the biggest in the country. So. I think the huge development that you see here has definitely kept me here, the technology development and uh, the continual educational development that you can put yourself through as well. I knew I always wanted to be a nurse. I didn't really want to go down the university route. I wanted to do something a bit more practical. So I found out about being TNA and the course itself. There's just so many different aspects of cardiology. It's not just having a heart attack, it's also different areas like heart failure, arrhythmias. There's always something new to learn. The whole plan when I started this job was to go to university and do the nursing degree. But then I've changed my mind because I would lose all of it, what I actually like to do, being able to have a chat with patients, to comfort them as, as we do. It's just all about the patients really, caring for them, helping them. I always knew I wanted to come into cardiology since my HCA days. It's the team. Team makes literally everything. As much as I love the pathology of it and the pathophysiology of it, when it's a busy day and it's a stressful day, the team makes it not so stressful, makes it not so difficult because you support each other. The support is so important. I just love the sheer variety that the role provides having been able to rotate through all the departments, so the ward, getting your ward skills, coronary care, so it's a lot more acute, and then into the cath labs where you can circulate scrub. You do get some very different um, cases. They come as emergency. I have been in the situation which in cardiac cath lab, we opened the chest with a cardiac surgeon, thoracic surgeon, perfusionist, everything. I've been in that situation. So it's very different, so you learn every day. When patients, they say thank you to you, when they include you to the letter they send us as a thank you to the team, it's just amazing. We are saving people's lives actually you know especially like our primary service when they come in and the the thanks and the gratitude that you get and the difference that you make is is just incredible really people that when they used to have a heart attack they'd be in for a week if not more you know we see more people surviving and then you do have the day case procedures as well so you get to do all sorts of different things 
in the lab, I do have them all time to give that proper personalised care as well, explain what's going on, making sure they're comfortable, giving them all like the right literature afterwards so they understand what's happened and yeah, putting them at ease as much as possible is what I like. And the different roles, you can be recovery, you can circulate, you can assist in the procedures. So that's what I'm learning to do at the moment. So that's a whole different skill set as well. So that's really good. There's lots of variety. Throughout the years as a healthcare assistant, I've worked in pretty much every ward in the hospital. But I think cardiology just really clicked. There was perhaps the opportunity to learn loads more skills. And I found that, you know, that was, was very appealing. Sometimes when you work somewhere, you just know that's the place you want to be. 